Hey, are you my average YouTube viewer? Because then I can entertain you for a solid 2 minutes 30 seconds. What am I doing with my life? Hey guys, GameFan here back with another Hero Sage video, this time bringing you the top 5 builds of Season 18. Now, the season has been going on for quite a bit of time now, and we had time to experiment with stuff, so we can see how the meta kind of works itself out. What my basis of these top 5 builds is going to be is based on two things. One is the rank 1 wormhole clear on softcore, second one is the average 15 clears. Because there will be some classes which have an amazingly high rank 1 clear, somebody who is extremely good at the class or has really good gear, but it's not that representative of the class's overall power. The endgame setups for these builds obviously include uh, heroic and angelic items, but if you want to just start out and try out a new class, these builds still absolutely hold up. And for number 5, we have the Nomad with a rank 1 clear of 210. Now, we have an amazingly fast uh, class here with pretty high area coverage, and it's probably one of the favorite choices if I were to make a character for Hell 5 boss rushes because that's one of the best ways to gain heroic items in this game is to do boss rushes and the nomad is an absolutely no-brainer choice when it comes to that. At number 4 we have the redneck with a rank 1 clear of 221. Now we have another relatively fast, not as fast as the nomad, but still very tanky and pretty huge area coverage. If I were to play any class in hardcore I would definitely go with this because of the high amount of armor and stamina this character is going to get from relatively early on and it's still pretty strong. Now before we get to rank 3, for rank 3.5 there could be technically the Jotun class mentioned, but um, that is, we're talking about a $15 uh, DLC class, which first of all I don't have, second of all I don't expect a lot of people to buy because it's a relatively good option to play when there are going to be free to play classes which perform be much better than him. At number 3 we have the Amazon with a rank 1 clear of 371. What I really like about the Amazon is first of all the super easy 600 movement speed, second is the hit and run play style of the poison. For most of the time with the Amazon you can just throw out a poison javelin and then move on to the next pack and the enemies several screens away will just, just die away, explode and spread poison to all the nearby enemies. At number 2 we have a little bit of a surprise with the pyromancer with the rank 1 wormhole clear of 414. Now this is what I'm talking about, weird mix of rank 1 clear and average clear. There is like 2 clears which are above 200 but the rest of the 13 top 13 clears are above like 50 or 60 while other classes average out like 90 to 100 but apparently it's still not dead from season 17. And at number 1 to nobody's surprise we have the marksman with a rank 1 wormhole clear on softcore of 488 and even the average clears are above like 150 to 200 so we are looking at probably the strongest class that we can you can play in season 18. Best thing about this is is that I've made a build guide about this which you can check out here wherever the screen it will be. There you have it, these are the top 5 classes to play in Season 18 for Hero Siege. If you have any questions, or there is another build that I totally didn't talk about that you might want to see a separate video about. Either way, let me know in the comment section, and until the next video guys, see you later, bye!